now I'm going to go through the first lesson on algebra and the first lesson what we will focus on is to learn how to do a very simple substitution accurately without making any color mistake so how you going to do it okay let's assume that given this four information p equal to three q equal to half s equal to negative four and y equal to negative two thirds and this is the formula given to you so the very first thing you got to do is to turn all these alphabet into a bracket so how are you going to do it very simple okay this is the way and what is the purpose of doing so is to let you take note of the negative sign when there is okay so after that what you need to do is plug and paste it over here you see s is negative 4 just copy and paste y is negative 2 thirds you just copy and paste it p is 3 and q is half after that okay you got to remove the bracket so how I could remove the bracket okay you need to take note of the sign this is positive 3 and this negative 4 different sign negative and 3 times 4 12 different sign negative okay over 3 minus half after that, combine them together. Put a bracket so that you can see it as one whole thing over one whole thing. Okay? This also to prevent you to make yourself confused. Okay? And after that, turn the mixed fraction into improper fraction so 12 that 3 36 plus 2 38 okay when you're simplifying to get the final answer remember that your equal sign must be on your left hand side okay over here so after that okay you need to re-modify your presentation over here into here okay. the purpose of turning the mixed fraction into improper fraction is to reduce the number of things that you look at over here there are three things over here there are two things so by reducing the number of things you got to handle psycho psychologically you make your mind think simple okay so after you see divide you turn it into multiply by turning the fraction upside down okay after that you just do a simple calculation Then at the end, you find the answer. And remember, your answer must be in terms of mixed fraction and it must be also lowest term. By following this way of presenting your working, you will make yourself able to have a momentum in doing maths. At the same time, you are doing prevention of academic mistake and also not to make yourself confused while you are working. If you're really interested to find out more about fellow maps and how it can help you to achieve A effortlessly, you may come on every Saturday or Sunday at 3 p.m. to have a talk with me. So, 
hope to see you there thank you